Okay, good evening, welcome to... Math and Math number 51. Math and Math number 51. So, um, you have to go to school early tomorrow, so we're just doing a quick problem late tonight. So I just picked, picked this one off the uh, 2007 AMC 10, mostly at random and mostly because I could write it out quickly. <laughs> so it says the numbers 1 through 8 are placed on the vertices of a cube so that the sum on each face is the same. And the question is, what is that sum? Okay, do you understand the problem? Yeah. All right. Go ahead. So, cube. So, I'm going to split them into pairs, 1 and 8, 2 and 7, 3 and 6, 4 and 5. Okay. So then you put like one one eight two seven and then I put these other two down here. But there's a slight problem with that. Okay. What is it? That this this face and this face don't add up to the same sum. Okay. It's an interesting idea then. So maybe if we order around. Oh, same problem. I mean, that idea sort of works, but how does it work for these sides? So each of the, the four numbers on each face have to sum to be they have to sum to be the same. Yeah. So and they're all different numbers. So what can we do? This idea might might have worked, but how do we fix this problem that you're running into here? Yeah, it's, it's a tough tough one, but tough problem to try to fix. Well, maybe it isn't isn't the right option. All right. Like what? But what else could you do? Well. I can say each of the numbers is going to be counted three times. Look at, look at the number that's going to be here. We counted once in this space, mm -hmm. once in this space, and once in this space. All right. So the total sum of all of these is going to be three times. 1 plus 2 plus double that plus eight. Okay. So and where is that? What is that sum? Where is that sum coming from? Well, you've to use the numbers 1 through 8, and they're counted three times. Okay. All right. So 3 times, and then so 1 through 8 is going to be 36 over 6 because this this would be for each face all right so 18 cool 
So your idea may have actually worked, because you had pairs that were summing up to nine, but it was tr tricky to figure out how, how to make it work. But your idea here was real nice. Add up all the faces. What happens? Well, I get six times whatever my sum is, but I also, in a different way of looking at it, get three times every number. So that's cool. So there's an even, there's a similar idea that's actually even easier than that. What happens when you just sum up the top face and the bottom face? Well, you get all the numbers. Yeah, or even the front face and the back face, any two opposite faces. And they're not overcounted. And there's no overcounting. So the sum is 36, and how many faces was that? Two. So what's the sum? 18. 18. Good job. Good work, honey.